All right, now I'm gonna do a crazy random video right quick, and then we're gonna go from there. So we're gonna do my Kirby Heritage 2, which that one came out in the mid 80s, and then we're gonna do my 80th Anniversary Edition Kirby Generation 4, which came out in 1994. Now uh, this vacuum back here in the corner um, came out, like I said, I think in 1984 or something, or 85. Might, may have been later than that, I don't know, but either way, that vacuum is over 30 years old. This one here is like 23 or 4 years old. Actually, it's older than that. It's about 25 years old. Um, this one here is the 80th Anniversary Edition, which came out in 1994. So... This one has an LED light installed. No, it's not factory. I did it on my own. Drive. This one has not been ran in a while. Like most everything hasn't been. Except for my century, I just ran it the other day. So. Give it a little nudge. Now, what I want to point out, there is a little. Uh, right here every time I roll my vacuum over it so it jumps. That's why it jumps. G4, 80th anniversary edition G4 versus Heritage 2. Now in this video we're going to do which Kirby runs the best is what I'm trying to demonstrate. Up next, my Heritage 2. I paid $15 for this one you just heard run. So. Excuse me. All right. This one here has not been ran in a while. Um, last time I ran it was about, about a week ago when I did my Heritage 2 versus both my G4s. And this time it's just 80th Anniversary Edition G4 versus Heritage 2. And I think I'm going to go ahead and throw my Sentry in on this one too. And again, which one runs best? That's a little bit wacky on this one. The only machine I have that does not have an LED light right now. Now you can see it is a little bit dusty from it not being used. this vacuum at Goodwill. I paid just a little over six bucks for it. And I will be eventually putting an LED light in my Heritage too. So, I will be putting an LED light in this one eventually. posting two videos within the next couple of days. Um, the one video which is on the phone that's on a charger right now 
It was my Bissell Momentum Cyclonic versus my G4. Now, keep in mind that I've had that Bissell for about six years. It came out in 2012, okay? Just to, just to clarify that for you guys. And then the Kirby I ran in that video was the one I got from my friend for nothing. Uh, I did not pay a dime for it. So. Ow! Okay. Next is my G10 Centria. The nasty tech drive issue. And by the way, the Centria is the newest Kirby I own, so. Here we go. Look at that, because that, yeah. All right, guys. Thanks for watching.